FTX examiner recommends further investigation into several aspects of collapsed FTX Group. Financial reports, court-appointed examiner Robert J. Cleary issued a detailed report recommending further investigation into several aspects of the collapsed FTX Group, focusing specifically on FTX, U.S., its asset management practices, and Sullivan and Cromwell, S&C, for legal representation. Zeroland, the first Evo airdrops project, has been launched and will airdrop 400 million zero. According to official news from Evo, on May 24, the first Evo airdrops project, Zeroland, has been launched and 400 million zero will be distributed to users who are eligible to receive Zeroland's Evo airdrops. The claim link will be online at 8 a.m. on May 24, UTC. There are approximately 2,000 wallets that meet this criteria. The snapshot was taken on May 15, 8 a.m. Universal Time Coordinated. The short investment price is pledgers who pledged more than 1,000 AEVO at the snapshot and zero pre-listing traders, linearly distributed according to transaction volume. Algorand Foundation New Ad Slams BTC, ETH, and Solana. According to financial reports, the Algorand Foundation released a new advertisement on YouTube titled, When Blockchain Meets the Real World, Only One Can Achieve It. The ad shows a supermarket checkout with shoppers trying to pay using three different crypto assets, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Solana. In the ad, a person trying to pay with Bitcoin is told by a cashier that he must wait because the transaction takes 27 minutes. Ethereum payers were told the transaction would be charged a $112 fee, and shoppers who chose Solana were unable to pay because the transaction kept failing.